Hello fellow YouTubers, this is Bill McFadden from Tone True Music, and in this video we're going to look at the different mic choices between Spitfire Chamber Strings Regular and Spitfire Chamber Strings Professional. Spitfire added some additional mic positions in the professional version. In particular, we have the alt mics in the regular Spitfire chamber strings, we have close, tree, and ambient. And the alt mics add three additional choices. You have close ribbon, stereo pair, and gallery. And also they have another one where they've you have your regular close, tree, and ambient, and then they've added the outrigger. So you get a different outrigger mic in addition to the... Uh, close tree and ambient. So let's take a look at the differences in the interface. Here's the Spitfire chamber strings and in the professional version you have an additional three folders. You have the alt mics, the CTAO, close tree ambient outrigger, and you have stereo mixes as well. So you get these three folders. So in your alt mics, you have your violins, one, two, violas, alt, celli, alt, basses, as well as your advanced extended techniques, uh, individual articulations and other patches, which are um, economic patches for the most part, light on resources. And then you have your performance legato, and as you can see, they're all alt. So everything in the alt filter, all these extended articulations are all alt. And then of course, in addition to the alt mics, you have the, the additional outrigger added onto the CTAs. So there's your CTA with the O's, okay. And also you have stereo mixes, which is an additional in the pro version. So the pro version gives you your stereo mixes. And if you see, if we go into that folder, we get your, these are the articulations available in the stereo mixes. And then, so the articulations legato, you have your longs, your spiccato, your staccato, pits, collegno, tremolo, minor, second, and your major second trills. And also in the stereo mixes, you have advanced, so you get into your extended techniques, so all stereos, and your individual articulations, as well as other patches, which again gets in the economic and then your performance legato, all stereo. So there is a lot of additional mic positions in the pro version, a lot of content. So right here you have all of these are what you get in your regular um, chamber strings. You get your violins, one, two, violas, celli, basses, and ensembles. And then you also have the advanced in the uh, regular chamber strings. So all of those articulations plus, um, basically it's all of those articulations with all mics, C, T, A, O, and stereo mixes in the pro version. So it's about equal to the content in terms of gigabytes. When you add on the pro version, you get an additional like 150 gigs or something like that. So let's go ahead and hear the sound difference. It's subtle. So let's take a look at the violins. And this one, so this is the regular Spitfire chamber strings with your close tree and ambient mics. So here's an additional 
comparison. Here's Violin's one with the CTAO, so we've added on the outriggers. And then here we have the alt mics. So there is a little bit more reverb going on. In the alt mics, the CR is your close ribbon, the ST is your stereo pair, and the G is your gallery. And then here we have the stereo mix. And in the stereo mixes, you have fine, medium, and broad. So F is fine, M is medium, B is broad. So here's the broad. Here's the medium. And here's the fine. So we've done the legato patch for these. Now let's go ahead and take a look at the next patch, which is the long patch. So I'll go ahead and do the key switch for the long patch, switch everything to long. So here's your regular CTA. CTAO. There's your alt mics. Your stereo mix. Here's your fine. Medium. Now let's go ahead and move on to the uh, spiccato. So here's your regular chamber strings. Here's the outriggers added. Here's your alt mics. And here's your violin stereo, broad. And here would be the medium. And you're fine. And then the next articulation we'll take a look at going to the right is the staccato. So here's your regular chamber strings. CTAO. Your alt mics. You can definitely hear the additional reverb in the alt mics. And then here's your stereo mix, which was made by I guess Jackson. And then here we have, um, that's the fine, here's the medium. It's Jake Jackson, actually. And then we have the broad. So the next articulation we have is a pizzicato. Regular chamber. Chamber plus the outrigger. And by the way, as I'm sure you know, most of you know, that you can change the levels of the close and the tree and the ambient, as well as the outrigger. Here's 
There's your alt mics. Your stereo. And this is the stereo with the broad, so here's your medium. And here's your fine. So then the next articulation we can take a look at is the collegno. So here's your, just your uh, close tree and ambient. And here's your outriggers added. Your alt mics. And then your stereo. Fine. Medium. And broad. And another thing you can do is you can add the uh, the five mic positions together. So if I add the close tree ambient outriggers and add in the alt mics, then you're getting all five mic positions simultaneously. So let's go ahead and take a look at the uh, next articulation. which is tremolo. So here's the tremolo in the violins, regular chamber. There's the three mics plus the outrigger. Here's your alt mics. And let's go ahead and do the alt mics and the regular four mics together. And then here's your stereo mix. That's the broad, here's the medium. And you're fine. So then the next articulation we have is the minor trills. Here's your regular chamber strings. Regular three mics plus L riggers. All mics. Mics plus regular mics. Stereo mix. Fine. Stereo mix medium. Stereo mix broad. And we have one left in the main articulations. And that's the major trill, major second trill. So here's your close tree ambient, close tree ambient outrigger, your alt mics, which consist of close ribbon, stereo, pair, and gallery. And then your stereo. Mix, and that's with the, the bra here is the medium. And here's your fine. So that pretty well wraps this video up for the comparison between the pro version and the regular Spitfire Chamber Strings version for the violins. So we can do a comparison of the uh, cellos, violas, and basses as well. So if you like this video, then please click like. 
If you wish to subscribe and become notified of upcoming videos, please subscribe. So this is Bill McFadden signing off from Tone Pure Music.